What is up everybody? So I know that geometry is a sore spot for so many students. So these are 10 questions you absolutely have to have down for the PSAT, SAT, and ACT geometry. Okay, let's do it. All right, so I am not a big fan of memorizing formulas unless absolutely necessary. And this is one of those cases where it is absolutely necessary to get these questions right. It says, which of the following is the equation of a circle with center two, negative three, and radius four? So here's the deal. Here we need to know the equation of a circle. And what is that? The equation of a circle is given as x minus h squared plus y minus k squared equals r squared. Now, let's talk about what each of these variables represents. So here's what happens. Take a look at your center, two, negative three. Your two, your x coordinate is always your h. Your negative three, your y coordinate is always your k. And then your radius here is your r, which is in this case, four. So now let's plug in those values. So what would we have here? Our h is two, so we have x minus h becomes x minus two squared. Plus, what do we have next? Our k is negative three, so we have y minus negative three squared equals our radius squared. And what was our radius? It was four, so we have four squared. So now, let's see how we can simplify this. Here we'd have x minus two squared, y minus negative three would be y plus three squared, and then we'd have equals 16. Now which of the answer choices gives us that? Answer choice E. Now for this question, it really just is about memorizing the formula for the equation of a circle. All right, guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me. Make sure to watch the rest of the videos in this series to get the help that you need for the PSAT, SAT, and ACT. And make sure to check out our other series. And if you haven't already, like and subscribe because this is obviously the best thing that's ever happened to SAT prep. <laughs> there we go. And I, like, yeah. love it. I think yeah. that's the one.